Alright. Alright, so today what we want to do is get you guys free Wi-Fi hotspot that you can use with your mobile data. And it's unlimited and it's free, which is pretty awesome. But what you want to do is go to your Play Store and look up PDA Net and do a search for that and you'll find this app the PDA Net Plus by June Fabrics Technology Inc. You go ahead and install that and it's pretty straightforward you know it's an app you just install it and then you go over to the app when you open the app this is where things are gonna get good the USB tethering option is for PCs so you can actually connect your phone to the PC with a USB tether. It only works on older devices. But <clears throat> in order to do that, let's say you don't have um, you know, internet on your computer, but you want to try and use your mobile data. Well, you'll click on the three uh, bar, the three buttons up here on the top right corner. Click on help. It's going to take you to this site. You need to click on I need help installing PDA net. Okay. Then the option that says how to install PDA Net Plus on my computer. What if my computer does not have internet access? So then you'll go and you'll click on this link, the PDA Net Co A link, and you'll need to download um, the Windows client or the Mac client. You'll download those and it'll go into your downloads folder and then you put it on your computer and run it just like any other application and it'll give you the step-by-step -step instructions to set that up once it does uh, and you get everything connected properly you should be able to tether straight to your computer from your phone's mobile data now let's say you're using the tablet or another cell phone also you're gonna need to install PDA net on the device as you can see here, it's got a Wi-Fi Direct Hotspot and a Connect to PDA Net Hotspot. Get online through another Android device. So that means that you have to have PDA Net on the phone or tablet that you're trying to connect with. And you have to have PDA Net for the Wi-Fi Direct Hotspot on the phone that's using the data. This is a little unfortunate, but with so many free hotspot areas like McDonald's, Walmart, you know, gas stations everywhere now all you got to do is download the PDA net on the phone with no data or the tablet with no data and then you should be able to use it unlimited the only thing that is different with the Wi-Fi hotspot and the tethering is that this is the free version so you only get so many megabytes before it's gonna kick you off all you've got to do is shut it off Okay, basically do this, restart it, and then you just you just shut it off, turn it back on, and you can reconnect and continue watching videos on your other person's phone or tablet or on the computer. Also, the Wi-Fi Direct Hotspot does work with PCs as well, so you don't actually have to do the tethering. You can actually use the hotspot if you have a Wi-Fi adapter for your computer and you can connect it directly through the Wi-Fi. There is one downside that kind of sucks and I have not figured out how to get Bluetooth mode to work but the downside is that you can only connect one device to this hotspot at a time. So if you have two or three people that want to use the the hotspot you won't be able to do that. You can only connect it, it, in my experience, you can only connect one device at a time. And I've been using this for like six years, something like that. And uh, I, I bought the full version, okay? And the full version is the FoxFi key. And it, as you can see, it looks identical to, P, it even opens PDA Net. But this FoxFi version gives you unlimited. I don't have to worry about the megabyte cap and then having to reset this every time I hit the cap. Uh, now I can just use it unlimited. And it's not a monthly subscription. It is one-time payment. It's only $8. I thought that was a pretty good deal considering what people pay 
for uh, mobile hotspot data from their, you know, their providers, from the service providers. So if you ever do need PDA Net or free hotspot, mobile hotspot, this app absolutely works. I've used it. I've gotten my sister to use it. My brother even downloaded it. This is definitely something that it works and you can test it for free. It doesn't work on all devices. Some of the older devices don't work so well, but you can test it for free and I think it's worth sharing so that people can, you know, save a little bit of money and 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 you know, have something that's that's actually going to benefit them. So Good luck out there, guys.